everybody in YouTube. This is Maria. Now, I'm recording this on my old iPhone 4, so I'm not sure how the quality will be. You know, having said that, I discovered something with my iPhone 5 that I'm so excited, especially to my loyal subscribers that have suffered through maybe not the best audio because I have been just using the iPhone's external microphone along with the video. I mean, sometimes it's not, you know, so bad because it's pretty good quality, but it's not like having a clean audio signal. So I've been talking to different people in the iPad Musician Group and the, and the um, uh, Synthesizer Freaks uh, Forum, also a Facebook forum, and, you know, they've been telling me you really have to get clean audio going into your iPhone or use a separate camera. So I figured out that this actually works. I'm so excited. So you see here I have the lightning adapter hooked up to the iPhone and you see the video is on there ready to go and here I don't even want to move it because I have it precariously propped but there is the Behringer UCA 222 or 222 it's called $30 I believe it's still $30 on Amazon and other places not that this is a an advertisement but I'm just so excited because it's not that expensive and it works so you can barely see through the wires but there are two um, RCA's in and that's going from the out of my mobile cube okay and then the out from here the two RCA's here are going into the in of my other mobile cube that I've had for several years and love so much too so hence I got another one and this one is cooler because you can actually use volume on the RCA or the quarter eighth inch input where you can't on here so you have to rely on the external source but I digress. Anyway, so now this is going into there. So you can, so I can hear what I'm playing because I have the headphone out being utilized here. Okay, so now I have my microcorg and my mini Nova um, into this mobile cube. You can get another couple of devices, but sometimes it could get too overloaded, but I've done it with the drum machine and whatnot. So what I'm about to do is show you that it does work because I have it hooked all up and you can hear everything go on and here. By the way, I use these presets by Mihail from Alba Ecstasy. They are so cool. Oh, I love them. Kudos to you, Mihail, for some great programming. So let me shut that art for now so you can hear me. So now I'm about to turn on the video recorder. So now it's recording, as you could see. And I'll play a few things. I'll put the ARP back on here. And just, of course, I need a third hand to do anything, but just like. Okay. So that's all I'll go with that. I just want you to hear how it works. So I'll shut it off. And now I'm going to go here, shut the recorder off, go back down here, and now I'll play it. You won't hear me speaking, obviously, because I'm utilizing the internal mic now. But soon, as soon as I start to play, there you go. And that is what... go it works I'm so excited I found a way where I don't have to invest any more money into a camera or any other kind of interfaces so if you want to try this uh, try it at home let me let me know what you think 